As you can see, this is a very, very risky strategy because you can very quickly get badly outnumbered. But 15 out of 17, that's better. It can also pay off quite well, especially if you've got good people. Uh, doesn't. Villagers. How is my money situation now? 5,000. Oh, I still need to... Damn it, I should have sold the... Oh, you watch. He'll have gone now. The ransom broker will have... He actually did as well. The ransom broker buggered off. Where'd he go? <sighs> Fine. Um, let's go to Craw. Maybe there's... The Nords have gone... To... Damn it. Uh, so... Well, we're fucked. <laughs> Let's charge the enemy. Um, okay, archers and infantry. There's barely any of you. We are so badly outnumbered, we can't bring more than... Actually, that's basically our entire force. But look at those Swadian knights and men-at-arms. That is, that is beautiful. That is genuinely beautiful. Whoa, lag. Since when does this game lag? Like, unless you've got a l hundreds of troops on it, doesn't usually. I suppose I do have it on, like, best settings and stuff, but it's still a really good computer. It shouldn't be having this much trouble. God damn, there's a lot of you. We are going to lose people here. Don't even think for a second we're getting out of this unblooded. Hell, I'll be lucky if I survive it. I'm just <laughs> dealing with this massive rabble. It's okay, guys. I'll get this slot. You just get, like, the little bad... Little, um... Collections of them. Oi, don't you throw javelins. That's rude. Actually, we seem to do... We seem to do a pretty damn good job of, uh... Cutting up the numbers. Hey. Throwing things is rude. Also, we lost a man at arms, which majorly sucks. Two men at arms, which majorly suck. <laughs> oh, come on. Sorry, I, I know I'm being a bit quiet, guys. This is just really intense. <laughs> and I leveled again. Oh, crap, I forgot to level last, last time, didn't I? Hey, on the plus side, any men at arms that survive this, you consider yourselves knighted. You deserve it. How many's left? Wow, we killed 50. Did we kill 50 already? What the actual. You see what I mean about <laughs> when I say that these guys are complete badasses? Swadian knights are literally the best cavalry in the game. Uh. You could call the uh, the KJ, I think they are. Their cavalry is also extremely good, the Lancers, but they're not as good. And damn it, one of them ran away. Anyway, I think it's safe to say we won that, but bloody hell. I'm sorry I was so quiet, that was just hectic as hell. And all our men cheer. We lost three men at arms, but considering how many we killed, I'm fairly happy with that. Uh, let's get the hell, what the hell, I'll take these guys. And a lot of really nice loot to sell. Makes me kind of wonder why... Um, well, there's some people that don't play this game for the battles. They play it as sort of like a role... Well, I say kind of as a role player. I'm role playing. But they play it as more of a... Trying to not get into battles. Because, in all fairness, it's not really that realistic that 20 people would kill 50. But, then again, in all fairness, screw you, that was awesome. <laughs> and that was an army of 78 people. That kind of scares the crap out of me. Just going to... Here. 
18 grand you can buy off me. Well, that's how much worth of stuff you can buy. I think that's pretty much... Yeah, I can't even sell you that much stuff. Damn. Oh, that's awesome. Getting all that money's going to really help us out in the long run. Or at least in the... Sh yeah, in the long run, because I'm saving up for the thing. I'm only three grand off now. The question is... Where do I put these two points? I think I want to get everything up to 12. So, two in agility. That means I can get my fourth point in riding. And then... Hmm. That's a good question. Another point in prisoner management, maybe? Uh, yeah, what the hell. And with all these points, I think I'll, I'm actually going to put some into throwing weapons. Because these are amusing as hell to use. There's something really funny about seeing your, well, Gwen, like, use a tiny throwing knife and just take down this massive, heavily armed uh, warrior with it. It's just so, I don't know why, I find it really amusing. Anyway, we need to get some more recruits, because our people are, well, we started out with, what, nearly 30 men and we're down to 17. It is kind of survival of the fittest. <laughs> oh, Nods. You just stay away from me. Stay the hell away from me and I won't fight. Can I join the battle? No. I'm, seeing as I'm not an ally of the Swadians or even a friend of the Swadians, I can't join in, unfortunately. Which really sucks, actually. Because that would be a great way to introduce yourself. Just fly into the middle of battle, swinging your sword. Or, you know, whatever you like to do on the weekends. I, I don't judge, you know. Some people like to knit. Other people like to go swinging swords at random people. Not my place in the world to judge. <laughs> uh, these Vegas, I don't know what to do with them. I might just use them as a bit of fodder, really. Upgrade. Oh, the village is being ra the village is being raided. Uh, can you go away? <laughs> yes, it's nice to meet you. Now sod off. I want to talk to the villagers. <laughs> Honestly, who do they think they are raiding? It's almost like this is medieval times or something. It's crazy. I think we've almost got enough. Yeah, we're back up to 30. Uh, no one here is willing to join me because I'm a woman, I'm assuming. Oh, 19 voice bandits. One second. Come here, you. I'm faster than you. And I've... I was faster than you. I've lost you. <laughs> Where'd you go? Here, voice, 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 bandits. Here, voice, 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 bandits. Are you in the forest? Wow. I can't believe I just had to ask that. That was rather silly. Uh, a lot more militia. To be fair, I'd much rather have a buttload of footmen with, you know, a fair amount of knights. Because I'm going to be recruiting uh, crossbowmen from another county. I've, well, I'll possibly be recruiting them from another county. It honestly depends on, you know, how how I go. Because I might just decide to not join uh, one of the other... I don't even know what you would call them. Kingdoms, I guess? Yeah. I might decide, I don't want to become a Rodokian. I don't want to become a Calradi... Uh, Swadian, or a, a vague, vague, uh, I might just want to attack the Nords on my own. There's no chance in hell that I'd survive, but it's, you know, I could attempt it. <laughs> it's actually quite bugging me now, where the hell are those voice bandits, like, they must have a base around there somewhere that they were going home to. And I'm not that slow. Okay, I'm quite slow, but... I've got... I 
should be able to find them. I want to find them so I can train some of my guys. Who did I just see? Deserters. Swadian crossbowmen. Manhunters. Swadian troops. Oh, you're mine. Come it. Damn it, you're faster than me. Uh, are you? No, you're not. Come to Gwen. And that's a sentence I never thought I'd say before in my life. Uh, militia to footman. There we go. And we're no faster. Wait, looters? I do not care about you. You are not as important. Swadian crossbowmen. I want to take as many of these prisoners as possible so I can recruit them for my army. And look at that army. It is literally just full of peasants. Get the mace out so we can whack some people on the head. God, remember a couple of episodes ago when I was having to do this with a stick? I felt I feel so uncivilized. Join my army. Join the army. I wonder if this is how armies in real life recruit people. They just walk around suburbs back whacking people on the head. Join the army. Hey. You like guns? Fwack! Join the army. <laughs> That'd be the most amusing way to like recruit someone to the army. <laughs> Ow! Damn it, knight. I know you're good at your job, but I want... You know, I want some of these guys as prisoners, not as your fodder. I mean, look how many of them... Wow, a militia got killed. God damn it. Look how fast these guys are dying. Swadian crossbowmen are not brilliant, in all fairness. Especially not compared to uh, Rodokian crossbowmen. But they are still fairly damn good. And look... All those man, those beautiful manhunters. <laughs> Five men at arms, four footmen. We are well along our way to getting. Oh, I've got extra here, haven't I? I've got my crossbowmen, my skirmishers. I'm gonna release you guys now, the mercenaries, because 15 dinars compared to 22, and these guys are better. So yeah. Sorry, but I'm I'm not sorry. <laughs> uh, Forest bandits. I'm just gonna release the Forest bandit and the Vega veterans. Uh, I don't really know what to do with you guys, so you can just go at the bottom. I only managed to get s wow. I didn't get many of them at all. And I'll just take that. That'll do me. And some more upgrades in the party. Footman, militiamen, awesome. So we have a fairly big army now, which means that we might be able to get away with sneaking all the way to Elden and, you know, doing a bit of raiding. Not much. Just quickly head sooner, see if we can't sell these guys, because they are really slowing us down. Buster. Okay, no, we can't. I might just have to set them free. Although... In all fairness, one second. Um, nope, camp, taking an action. No one will join me. Well, looks like we're going. You're dragging along with. Wow, that was a fail at talking. We are dragging you along with us. <laughs> Those 15 people are just like having to run as fast as our horses can walk. I almost feel sorry for them. Almost. They are sea raiders. So the question is, once we get our finances sorted, which is what I'm doing at the moment, I'm raising money so we can buy uh, businesses, which will keep us with an uh, income as we build up our army. The question is, who do we join? Do we join anyone? If we join a, a kingdom, we are much more likely to actually completely wipe out the Nords. Because, on our own, we are very, very tiny. The Nords have hundreds upon hundreds of troops. And they can replenish those. And they can, you know, keep hundreds and hundreds of troops in one army. And, you know, we just have no chance of outnumbering them. 
or even having anywhere near their numbers. Which means that chances are we're going to want to join someone else in order to, you know, have the extra manpower that comes with having a big kingdom. Unfortunately, that would also mean that we wouldn't exclusively be at war with the Nords. There would be times when we were at peace with them and times when... Oh, damn, I can't... I can't loot them, can I? I can force them to give me supplies. Yeah, you can give me stuff. Grapes. I'll take it. <laughs> and I can steal the cattle. I, c I can steal your food. I'm only doing this because the Nords, you know. Uh, she would not agree with doing this if it was anyone else. So I'm just going to steal all their stuff. I'm not going to a Nordic town to sell it. And, yeah, as you can see... Now that we're starting to get uh, Swadian Knights, our requirements have... Just look how much that is costing us per week. And we've got a fairly small number of them, only four. That is going to get extremely, extremely expensive. But it is very much worth it, because we will be able to take on... You know, armies when we are vastly outnumbered, which is what we need, because we are going to be vastly outnumbered against the Nords. But yeah, it is a tough question, because, as you can imagine, we don't really want to be fighting anyone else. But, you know, if we have to do what we have to do, it in order to finally take down the Nords, but it just takes a while longer, it's... You know, what do you do? <laughs> okay, I'm going to go up to the Sea Raider landing again. Because that seemed to get us a lot of money last time. Also, a lot of experience. And now that we have the numbers to actually face the, like, 50-odd numbered um, hordes of raiders, I think we can survive. Instead of just running away with our tail between our legs. Oh, more people ready to upgrade. We are just really running through these upgrades. Okay, let's... <gasps> they don't actually dare go back to their own base because I'm here. Well, I'm faster than you so I can chase you down, you little crap. Oh! Oh, your friends didn't join you. Damn it. Uh, there was like a group of them just just behind them that wasn't quite in range. Oh well. Oh look, this is beautiful. You know, I I'm going to enjoy myself and kill some of them. I'm not going to worry about taking them alive or expenses, that kind of thing. I'm just going to massacre them. Oh, fail to. You know, that works too. I got one. That. I got two, I'm happy. <laughs> Come on, my men. Kill them all. They are Nords. Each and every one of them. They sleep with fish and... I um, actually don't know that much about Nords. <laughs> what are they supposed to do that's really horrible? Other than be giant dicks about raiding everyone. Like, I know um, all about Normandy, you know, invading Britain. Because we'll learn about that in history, but I... Wow. Nice shot. Damn nice shot. Who are you? Oh, you're a militia. <laughs> I was thinking, do we really have some crossbowmen in? But we've only got like three archers. Damn it. Failed. Well, this did not take long. <laughs> hey, they're still a survivor. You have to admit, from where we started, we've come a long bloody way in such a short time.